everyone. Welcome back to ROS 299 or 2998. This is our YouTube channel. Today we're going to be opening another snack crate. Look, we have guests. We have Amy and Chris. Hi. And we thought, okay, in case y'all don't trust our opinion, again, you got Canna, Britt, and Bobby. And we will open up this crate and find out if there's all kinds of good stuff in there. This month our crate comes from Brazil. And again, visit snackcrate.com and check out all their good stuff. Are you guys excited? Very good. <laughs> Let's see what we got. Okay, again. It's all packed in there nice and pretty. We got cool little Brazil. And these brochures, when they come in them, not only do they tell you what's in the crate, the first page of it will tell you all about different cool stuff in their country, stuff you may not even know. And you gotta love that outfit, right? Definitely. <laughs> okay, so let's get started. Again, Snack Creek stickers. I think Chris and Amy have to have the stickers this time. Because it's cool, but kind of funky, like tribal dancer stickers. Brazilian. Brazilian stickers. Okay. Let's open this up and see what's all in here. Well, it's very colorful. It is. It's all packed in there nice and pretty. So, who's going to pick what we try first? I'll go first. Okay. I love picking. <laughs> all right. Let's start with this. What looks like that pizzeria, so let's start with this one. Like this back over here. I'm totally going to butcher this and I apologize. So if anyone could let me know in the comments on how to properly pronounce this, that would be awesome. It's Parade Pizza? Pizza King? Pizza? Yeah. <laughs> here we go. I can't read any of this. It's a Brazilian. Here we go. Pizza King. There we go. Pizza flavored snacks. Okay. I like this bag, it's super cute. Oh, and as cute as it is, there is no translation on here. So, <laughs> what the bag says is what it is. Oh, there we go. There's like, a lot of flavoring to them. They look like little crackers. Those are have a lot of seasoning on them too. All right, guys, here we go. These smell like they tomato look, and oregano. They look grainy, like. Like wheat thin or something. They don't have as much flavor as it looks like, which is on there. They taste like oregano. They taste mm -hmm. like a pizza crust, right? Mm -hmm. They do. So they're not bad. They're like a pizza Pringle. I think they're pretty good. Yeah. Reminds me of. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, they're not bad. I expected them to have a lot more flavor with this, the way the yeah. crackers look. They look like there's a ton of seasoning on them. But they're good. Alrighty. I'm going to set those right there so you can keep seeing them. Amy, you're going to reach oh, into our nifty back too. This is just an air bubble packet. Well, let's try these. You have to pronounce it though. If you pull it out, that's your job. <laughs> well, I don't know if I'm going to do that properly. <laughs> pa Paquita? Pa Paquita? Um, We're sorry for butchering all of this. I Feel free. Deeply apologize. Don't really know what it's supposed to be. There's two of them in the box. You can see what it looks like here. It's made by Santa Helena. We'll put that one right there so you can see it. <laughs> all right. Well, let's see what's in here. Let me set this on the other side. Right? It looks like... Um, it's <laughs> Looks like... <laughs> We're like, I don't know. It doesn't really look like anything. It looks like a fig cookie. Yeah, it's really oh, soft. Fig. Kind of, yeah. Like the outside like of a fig Newton. <laughs> it smells peanut buttery. Oh, it's very crumbly. Oh, it does smell like peanut butter. Mm -hmm. It's oh. a peanut butter cake. Like just oh. a ball of peanut butter smashed together. <laughs> All right. <laughs> If you like peanut very, butter, it tastes like peanut you like butter. Peanut. It's very it's sweet, like and I do love peanut butter. And this, this isn't bad. 
It tastes like a ball of peanut butter. Yeah. Like a crunchy <laughs> peanut butter. Maybe with some powdered sugar mixed in. Like the Christmas peanut butter balls. Yeah. Peanut balls you get at Christmas time. That's what it tastes like. Not bad. Interesting. That's, good. That's pretty good. Don't fit off in here so that our peanut butter lover can finish it. <laughs> well, later. Or do you want to leave it up? All right, Chris. It's kind of fun having a guy out here. We've never done that, so be a fun choice. There go. Uh, looks like a churro stick. It is a Feeny Red Goddess Two <laughs> Churros. This is what happened when the white boys tried to speak in Mexican. <laughs> or Spanish. <laughs> Hold it with there's so what? Sobraro Churros. Churros! Okay, so I love brush churros. I'm not sure I've ever had one out of a package. I can't so say that I have. I have not. We will see how this <laughs> works out. It'll be interesting. <laughs> But I love churros, so yeah. we'll see if it actually tastes like one. It, it looks like one, yeah, kind of. It looks like a chocolate <laughs> churro. Looks like a candy it version. It has yeah. sometimes filling in it. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's like, not all fresh and crispy and like, like a butterfinger. fresh one is. Mm -hmm. It's is it, it looks it's like kind it's of a chewy. chewy. Yeah. Okay. Maybe like a taffy, soft taffy. Hold up a piece so you can kind of see what it's like. I know we're a long ways away. Yeah. We have a big group today. There you go, Brittany. Yeah. So you can't even really see, but it's got a lighter filling on the inside. It's like a chewy candy. It's not got flaky a like a churro on the outside. Yeah, what do you think, Chris? Sugar it on the has outside. a sugar coating on it. You can see the crystals of sugar on it. All right, guys. It smells like toffee. Mm-hmm. Oh, it does. It tastes like coconut. Kind of. <laughs> it's very that. chewy. It tastes like <laughs> very chewy. A pina colada. Almost has a licorice texture. Oh, yeah. Chewy, like a licorice. Yeah, it's not bad. It's no, good, it's but not bad. Yeah. I definitely think one bite is going to be sufficient. It definitely. It's, it's very sweet, and it does kind of have a funny aftertaste. Yeah. It doesn't taste well, like a churro. I was misled. <laughs> it don't taste like a churro. Sorry. It says churro on package. Oh. Okay. All right. Back to our box from Brazil. And this is kind of funny. There is a bag of ruffles. Ruffle potato Perfect. chips. However... I cannot read what flavor it is. It's churrasco. Saber churrasco. Is it going to be like a churro again? Yeah. yeah. So I don't know if it's going to be hot or the package makes you think that it's hot. All that red and blue on there. Yeah. Hung out. yeah. It's a very pretty package. And it's on the back it says hashtag to do mundo. So. But everything on this package is actually kind of cool for somebody who don't know. Spanish, you can't read it, but everything on the package is pretty much wrote in Spanish. Or, I am absolutely Brazilian. sorry if Brazil does not speak Spanish. <laughs> it is wrote in whatever language they sell in Brazil. You want to hold them up there and you can see the package a little bit better? And the tongue's one of the ruffled chips, so maybe that's what we'll be expecting. <coughs> I think that's what gives me the thought that it's hot. Yeah. You know, when you see something with the tongue sticking out, it kind of makes it think toxic. It reminds me of a kiss. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> a kiss. But, ironically... Oh, they look like plain ruffles. They look like plain ruffles. They're, it don't look like there's any flavor on them at all. They smell plain. I'm going to say they smell like plain ruffle potato chips, so I'm going to go with this one. They smell vinegary. Mm -hmm. um, <laughs> okay. It tastes like flavor. tuna. That's exactly what I was going to say. It tastes like canned tuna. Yes. 
So whatever saber churrasco means, it means tuna. <laughs> it screen with it definitely tastes like tuna. <laughs> that is definitely weird. It's interesting. I've never had <laughs> tuna on chips before. So okay, so I make tuna on crackers. <laughs> not the same concept. It's just a lot easier as a snack. <laughs> That is not good. So if you like tuna and you like potato like chips, this is a snack for you. Lemon pepper tuna. <laughs> and it's not good. Sorry, Brazil. Don't Brazil. like the ruffles. Or Frito-Lay. Or, I don't even know. Does Frito-Lay do ruffles there? PepsiCo, so probably. Yeah, Frito-Lay. Oh, there it is. Oh, it's not with that sauce. Elma. So if anybody wants to try these, let us know. We'll mail them to you. Say, I don't like tuna. tuna. <laughs> Those are the chips for you. If you want to try them, go buy plain potato chips and put some tuna on them. <laughs> Not even the tuna, just soak it in the oil from the yeah. tuna. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Definitely. Alrighty. So we only have a couple things left in our box from Brazil. We got the min the smaller box because this was in addition to our regular box this month. So it's kind of smaller. There's not a whole lot of items in it. But we have two things left in here. There's this little guy for whoever wants to try it, and then there's four pieces of, five pieces of candy. We'll just cut that one, we can all try it. So okay. this says Tachau. Tachau? Tachau, yeah, I would say Tachau. Tachau. Banana Ina from chocolate, so I'm guessing maybe it might be banana flavor. I'm thinking chocolate, chocolate banana. Chocolate flavored banana. But I don't know. So, unfortunately on this one, I am going to pass trying it simply because I am extremely allergic to bananas. So Good until excuse. these guys try it and let me know if, excuse. if it is banana flavor, I am going it's, to have to step by it. Looks and, like dark chocolate. And unfortunately it's the one thing in here that has chocolate on it. It does have, love chocolate. It <laughs> does have banana in it, so you won't be able to try it. Don't it change kind of, oh, it's dark in the middle, too. Like, like it's spice. chocolate all the way through. Yeah. Milk chocolate on the outside, it's but it's soft. in the middle. Kind of like a marshmallow yeah. cream you got in there. Ooh. It feels like fudge, just like, like a thing of fudge. Like a chocolate-covered fudge yeah. ball. It reminds me of a chocolate-covered marshmallow. Yeah. Okay, here we go. And that's what it tastes like. The chocolate covered marshmallow. It's really sweet. Very. Does very it taste like banana? Me. No, it tastes like cherry. It does not taste like, like banana at all. It tastes oh. like strawberry, cherry, cherry. Okay, like do I have to go with Amy's face because Amy don't like chocolate? No, I really don't. <laughs> it's got like a chocolate covered cherry. It's yeah. got a different aftertaste to it. Definitely not what I was expecting. None no, at all. <laughs> So, so we'll give the next thing a shot. Here. I would I would say that if you like chocolate fruit or chocolate covered berries yes. and stuff like that, that'd be a good yes. I don't know candy for you. See that? Whatever. Yeah. Hold it there. So see what it looks like, how we were talking about it looks like. It definitely does taste like a fudge. You can't really see chocolate. it all that well. Yeah, that's good. Right. There you go. Alrighty, kids, real quick, in here. I always forget to mention this, so that I saw it while they were doing this last piece of candy, and I wanted to bring it out that there is a complete nutritional fact in here. So really, I probably could have looked this off there if there was bananas, but I don't know. I don't want to read all the ingredients. So that is always way at the bottom underneath the paper, so that's how I tend to forget about it. <laughs> so the last piece of candy is here, and I think they are cute. They're, They're called hard. Seven Bellow. Which might be seven diamonds because it's, there's a playing card that's the seven of diamonds on the package. So if anyone knows what Bella means, please let us know in the comments. I can tell you Bella in Italian is beautiful. Well, but I don't know what Bella in oh, Brazil is. It looks like taffy, hard taffy. Mm -hmm. Like a now and later thing. It's very Here's hard. Starburst. I'm going to have it. say a flavor it on it at all? Uh, well, it I guess I wouldn't know if it says a flavor. I can't it's read it. Hard. Pink. And I don't know the flavor. I'm, I'm taking that. a smaller piece because if it's really hard to chew, I don't want to be The stuck. inside looks different. Yeah, it's kind of, life. I don't know if it's a white or if it's just really light pink from cutting it. It looks like bubble gum. It, it does. It like, looks like pink bubble gum. Bazooka Joe. Oh, it tastes like bubble gum. 
It tastes like pink Starburst to me, like strawberry taffy. It tastes like it's, it's definitely a taffy. <laughs> it is kind of bubblegum flavored, actually, like a strawberry bubblegum taffy, mm -hmm. like the ones that you get in the circle little containers of gum tape. Oh, it tastes like that. I it's wonder if bad. Bello means bubble. Oh, maybe. 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 This is actually gum. Yeah. <laughs> well, uh, we all we'll just swallow it. So that's what it looks like. If we're still chewing in 10 minutes, it's gum. But <laughs> <laughs> Of course, I don't know. It's taffy. It could be. Those aren't bad, though. No, no they're not bad. So, Brazil, I give that one a thumbs up. That's definitely, mm -hmm. I like that one. Not too it's sure not about good. the rest of your snacks. I'm sorry, Brazil. You're still a super awesome place, though. Definitely. It's not gum. It's definitely taffy. It breaks down. Yes. So, what's about? I mean, once again, sorry as I choke on the taffy. <laughs> It was an awesome, like, I liked doing the Brazil one. It was definitely different from what we're used to here in the States. I like the, I actually like the chips. Uh, the flavor of it is unique and way off what I expected, but it, I like food and crackers. So. You're a brave one. <laughs> Chris is our foodie. We go on He'll vacations or we go to different places, and he's the one where we're always like, Here, Chris, you try it. Because yeah. Try it, let's know it's good. Anything. You don't know if you don't like it, don't try it. Unfortunately, he likes a lot of foods that. Mm -mm, not, so, I'm not even trying. He'll tell us they're good, but. We don't know if to believe him or not. <laughs> <they're> not <good. laughs> okay. But. So again, it's been so much fun having yes. Chris and Amy here with us. Thank you, Brazil, oh, thank you for, for their awesome box. Getting more opinions, and that's the Brazil snack crate. As I said, this is not this month's snack crate. This was kind of an addition. That's why it's smaller. There wasn't as many items in here. and it's, But there are several different sizes that you can order. When you go onto their website, there's the mini one, there's the original one, there's the premium one, and then there's one with a drink upgrade. I think the original is what we normally get, yes. so to kind of give you an idea of how many items go from this is the mini to the original, you get quite about a few double, more. About double the items, I items. Say. Also, if you order from our YouTube channel and you enter the link that we're going to be posting, you will be able to save, I think it's 10% on it. I will double check that and I will put it in the comments. But we just got a cool thing that, hey, order the snack rates directly through this YouTube channel, and you'll get a deal, and we'll get a deal, and it makes all the world a happier place. Well, make sure to put the referral code down below in the description. Make sure that you like our videos. Make sure to subscribe. Check us out on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter. We're excited to hear from you. Let us know what you think about the videos, and if there's any videos that you would like to see us unboxing in any specific places. And this snack crate, snack crate is that hashtag launche. I think launch, 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 launch. Hashtag Brazil things. <laughs> <laughs> but again, thank you to Chris thank and you. Amy. Did you guys have fun? Yes, yes thank you. Thank you. Good. Check, come back and watch us. We're actually going to be posting another video today from. It's not from the snack crate company, but it's from another company that we ordered from Mexico. And I'm not sure what's in it, but this thing is heavy. So, stay tuned. Check out our next video as soon as we drop these. Bye, guys. Bye. See ya. Bye.